Okay, so what's the plan? So I just thought we would come out. Hold up. Why are you talking like that? Talking like what? Like that. This is my authentic Spanish speaker's accent. No, man. That's how they talk in movies and in cartoons when they're being made fun of. Look, man, you can be offended or not, but this is just like me practicing my accent. Yeah, man. Okay. So what's the plan? Well, I'm just gonna, like, introduce some Spanish words and... Whoa, 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 what's that? It's a Spanish word. How are you even doing that? It's like magic, man. I know. Okay. Okay, let's just do this. Okay, so the word is pelirrojo. I don't think you need to roll your R's that much. But I do. That's how I do it. Pelirrojo. Okay. Uh, it's got pelo in it, which is hair, and uh, rojo, which is red. So, uh, red-haired, red-headed. You're right. It means red-haired. It also means a person who has red hair. Pelirrojo. Pelirrojo. Okay. Um, camisón. Like camisa? Yeah, but it's like camisón. Camisón. Um, big goofy shirt? Yeah, it's like a big goofy shirt, man. That's what it is. That's what it is, man. No, I was just kidding. What's it really mean? Well, it's like a camisa, but then it's like, oh, so it's like big and goofy. It's a big goofy shirt. Yeah. It says night shirt right there. Yeah. It's like a big goofy shirt that you wear in the nighttime. I don't wear nothing. Can we have the next word, please? Ah, uh, párpado. Párpado. Easy. I know what that means. Yeah, it's like uh, it's like your eyelid, cause it's like parpadear is to uh to blink, and like parpadeo is a blink, so it's like uh, it's what you blink with. I thought it was like a wall. No man. No, it, it it's it's an eyelid. See. Paramo. Lover. No, you're thinking of like paramour. Eh, it's not a paramour. It's a, uh, it's like a mesa, like a table. No, like a mesa. That means table. Yeah, but it's also like a geographical feature. It's like a high plateau. See. So it means mesa. Why didn't they just say mesa? Well, there's like another word for it. It's like a plateau. Okay, it's not exactly a mesa. It's like it's like a flat place that's like high up like maybe if you live in the mountains but like you got like a big open field like the sound of music like that's a that's a paramo pelado yeah man pelado I don't know what that means well like sound it out Okay, um. Well, like, pelar, it means, uh, pelar means to peel. Yeah, man, go with that. Okay, so it means, like, peeled? Yes. Yes, it does. And it means bald. Yeah, like, if you're bald, then it's like you've been peeled. Or you could think of, like, pelo, like skin. Like, if you're bald, it, you, it's just, it's just skin. Oh, okay. So like pelado means bald or peeled. Right. La tier. La tier. La tier. La tier means to beat or throb. I think it might be related to like a latigo, like a whip, but like uh, it could be like a heartbeat. Is like latido de corazón. It's just a beat, man. It's like a throb. Okay. I dig that. How am I going to remember that? I don't know. Like, latigo? Or like, latido de corazón? Oh. 
Okay. Zelda. Is that like the one that got the legend? Of no. No, man. It's not the one that got the legend about. A Zelda is, is like a... Was well, like a cell. Like in your body. No, man. Like, like in a prison cell. But not the ones in your body. No. Like a prison cell. Or like a cell in the dungeon. Like, put him in his cell. He's been... He's been... Refusing to tell the king the answer, so we put him in the cell. Yeah. Yeah. Like a prison cell. Dar lo mismo. Shouldn't it be dar el mismo? No, it's like dar lo mismo. The lo is the, but it's like a special the. It's like that which is. Like to give that which is the same. It means to give that which is the same? No, I'm just like translating it literally. But like it means like to not matter. Like I don't care. It gives me that which is the same either way. So like me da lo mismo. Okay, that makes sense. You're like after I explain it so well. I'm not sure that Okay, go ahead. You got another one? Yeah, like this one it means not matter. Yeah. Okay, Tejado. Isn't there, don't we know a guy named Tejado? No, 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 that's Tejada. Um, Tejado is like that which has been done with Teja, with, with tiles. So it's like a tile floor? No, 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 it's, you didn't let me finish. A Tejado is a word that means a roof, especially like a tiled roof. But it could be any kind of roof, even if it doesn't have tiles on it. So is that like your little mnemonic device, or is that an authentic etymology? Oh, you know, is is Okay, so it means a roof. Okay. Pulmon. Pulmon. Like a pulmonary surgeon? Yeah, like a pulmonary surgeon. So it means heart? Come on, man. What? Pulmonary surgeons don't, they're, they're not heart surgeons. Aren't they? Like my dad had like heart problems and he had to go see a pulmonary specialist. That's, that's cardiac. Cardiac, like corazón. No, he went to see a pulmonary specialist. You're an idiot. Look, I don't talk about you. Pulmon means lung. Yeah, man, it's a lung. And it's like... Hey, can I take a pulmon? Uh, just stop, okay. It means lung. Okay, uh, I got this one. Uh, cortar is to cut. Uh, cortado means cut. Uh, recortar means to cut or trim, like to cut repeatedly or excessively. So like trimmed against. Uh, I don't got it. It means silhouetted against. You can also say recortado sobre. Yeah, that makes sense. I'll buy that. You don't have to buy it, man. I'm telling you. No, I believe you. It's nothing about belief, man. It's like it's written right there. Okay. Uh, can we not fight? Okay. And the last word is barullo. Barullo. You know, don't roll your R. It's just one R. Barullo. That's what I said. No, you were like Barullo. Barullo. What's it mean? It's like a... It's like a ruckus. Or a fuss. Or a mess. Thanks everyone for coming. Tune in for set two. Coming soon.